Hey, what up, what up? Yo, what up? I got this jacket on because ah, I just turned my heater off and uh, it's kind of chilly. It's not chilly out. If you're in the sun, it ain't chilly. Trust me. You don't need a jacket. But I like to sometimes warm my vessels on the outside of my body. Because uh, those are the ones that kind of uh, fail a lot of times, especially if you don't um, just constantly work out and try to figure ways to uh, reverse telomere destruction in your nervous system. Other than that, uh, you still have to try to get the exterior of your vascular systems warm. So whether or not you're cold or not, you sometimes need to do this. But not when you're hot, just when you're cold. So this video is about how I define myself. Racist to some people possibly, but absolutely not. I'm just going to right off the bat tell you. My favorite YouTube skit maker is Jeremiah Phillips. My favorite speaker, somebody I would actually vote for president for if he was to run for it, would be Jericho Green. All right, so go on his channel and buy his gear because the guy is the smartest fucking guy I've ever fucking heard. And he cusses a lot. And I don't give a fuck what anyone says. You know, uh, now I am white. My preference is to be white, but I very rarely run into smart motherfuckers and Jeremiah Phillips is a good skip maker. Jericho Green is a fantastic, intelligent person. As in, I don't think I could beat him the way he makes his points. Um, at least communication-wise, just any individual. Now, do I kowtow to blacks? Eh, shit, not really. I mean, I, I could say some things I, that aren't good, you know, about blacks. And, and one of them is, you know, first of all, you know, I, I really don't want to get into this really – in a long way, but I will say this. Of course, my heart goes out to anyone who's ever a slave, but uh, the whole human population are slaves. They just don't know it, right? The, the, the powers that be, the Republicans, the Democrats, they're all hand in hand, similar. They're the same. They run each other uh, so that the outcome will be just for their liking and the elite, the people who want to you know, raid the cookie jar, steal, steal, steal. And if there is an agenda to knock out the population of human beings, guess what? They're going to make as much money until that happens as possible and fuck with you as much as possible and still study and do whatever they can. Hopefully, they'll have enough time to do some shit before they end up going bye-bye by somebody other than mankind. Okay, so that's kind of how I think. And I, another thing is black slaves were the recent ones, okay? But slaves existed in every every de uh, you know department. You can call it uh, Caucasians were slaves. Do you want to go look it up? No, because academia doesn't want you to know because they're run in the same way the media is by Republicans and Democrats, Democrats and Republicans. The whole academic thing is to uh, persuade people not to understand what's going on. That's why even somebody as bad as Hitler went and studied in India, found out about the Sanskrits, found out that there were warring uh, parties that were above and outside of the earth. OK, and figure out a few things. Now, yes, he did kill a bunch of Jews. And, you know, I'm not going to sit here and talk about all that. But, um, you know, quite frankly, uh, you know, when you're talking about intelligence, first thing is first. Um, do you resonate with me? Does it matter what color you are? Absolutely not. It doesn't. Now, I will say this. What I was going to say was, you know, I don't want to point the finger at blacks, but, you know, most fathers do not want their children after they have a family. Uh, if they're more or less poor, they'll just exit. They'll exit the whole situation. So when people say Black Lives Matter, go look at the FBI statistics. The same amount of white people versus the same amount of black people that exist today in America. If you have it split that way and leave out all the other whites, more whites are killed by police every day. Right. So, I mean, it's, it's not hard to figure out that we are being hoodwinked all along. Uh, make sure that, you you know, for some reason or other, there's an agenda probably from people like George Soros who run Black Lives Matter, by the way, and, and supply them with money. You know, as somebody who should have been in prison a long time ago for antagonizing countries and creating scenarios. Now, falsifying scenarios, of course, making people believe one thing. So more or less, they're all his Manchurian candidate. OK, so that's how I think. All right. So a lot of people think, uh, you know, no, uh, he, he's, he's a racist. No, I'm not. Like I said, Jeremiah Phillips, my favorite skit comedian on YouTube, 
a Jericho Green, the smartest motherfucker I've ever, ever fucking heard. And maybe I should refrain from calling him a motherfucker, but I got a kind of a bad mouth too. Uh, you know, if he was running the country, I would feel a lot safer, you know, because he seems like he's super smart. Unlike, even though I like Trump, Trump is not super smart on uh, the, some of the people he hires. Trump, you know, he's hired some of the people he hired, you know, just fucking, I don't want to even think about it. But as a businessman, he's smart. Okay, he's not smart so much as in the people he hires for his fucking shit. Now, that that being said, that is why a fraudulent um, scenario with, uh, you know, Dominion, uh, uh, deceptive Dominion software uh, is is why most people are just going to let this next president take over. And because Trump didn't, you know, particularly set everything up so that he was prepared, as far as I'm concerned, to show uh, by, with proof, and there is proof, but the Democrats don't answer the, to the questions because they feel that since uh, somehow or another they're not obligated to uh, go under interrogation about fraud, but yet they'll sit there and say Biden won fair and square. It's easy to figure out how many Manchurian candidates are out there being programmed to act a certain way, whether it's based on the monetary they need to acquire because they're afraid of all us crazy motherfuckers that might just shit on their driveway and next who knows what we'll do and stuff like that. And that would, you know, we're talking about Nancy Pelosi. Who knows what somebody's going to do when they get extremely upset at these people. Now, a lot of these people, you know, whether they think they, they know they're wrong Maybe a lot of them even know they're wrong, but they're still Manchurian candidates because they're working for somebody else. Even though they know they're wrong, they're working for somebody else so they can line their pockets. That's why Biden has not really uh, come out and talked about his illegal activity when Trump was exonerated. All right. So my thinking is this. Just remember, if you can't hack your own uh, control mechanisms, which in many cases could involve another uh, you know, kind of being, then you also need to hack what the humans are trying to intervene to hack with, which is to understand uh, who is controlling you, what, how you work as a biological robot by giving you an inoculation, a falsified inoculation by design for biological warfare so that they can either turn off a large portion of people and they're not worried about monetary because these elite people only have a monetary for particular reasons. Uh, but the truth is, the people that run us don't care about, uh, you know, uh, all that. They'll, they'll make, the, you know, any human that goes along with a scenario to distribute this cell poisoning uh, uh, coronavirus, which it starts out really slow, like, a, like it is a rhinovirus, which it would never do damage if they didn't mess with it. They manipulated a rhinovirus, also known as the coronavirus, to uh, poison cells. Okay, now uh, that is the opposite of what your immune system is supposed to take care of. But because it's designed that way, and it was only maybe released in the bat, but the truth of the matter is, it was just a bi it's biological warfare. They just use that as their MO. Oh, it was released by a bat. Uh, yeah. Okay, guys, that's my uh, shit. Get used to it.